It just snapped. There's banana all over my notepad now. Damn it. Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Craig here from Video Juice and we're back with another Iron Fist reaction. Episode 11 this time. Not many left now. Um, last time on Iron Fist, shit hit the fan. Colleen is with the hand. Bakudo is with the hand. There's apparently different divisions of the hand or whatever, or like Madame Gao is apparently the head of a, a rogue division that is evil, but Bakudo, but I think that like Bakudo is just lying because he does seem like evil. <laughs> he seems bad. Um, and maybe Colleen just has this skewed version. Uh, she is like been lied to and I think everyone has been lied to, even the people getting trained there. Um, but Bakudo definitely has ulterior motives and he wants Danny for something. A while Stavos appeared, um, he was he was Danny's old friend from Conlon. He came there to get Danny to bring him back to Conlon. At the end of it, it looked like they were going to go back there. He they eventually got out. We got some cool fights. Um, we had like three big fights in it. We had another hallway scene. We had a fight where um, Danny and Davos were fighting all of the hand students, which was cool. And then Colleen left them out at the end. Um, and then she left as well. So she might be like <laughs> rethinking her life there was i found it odd that colleen was like she had been saying like these are my family i've been with these f my my life and all this kind of stuff and then she instantly betrayed him for danny someone she she has just met now granted she has strong feelings for danny and all that but she flip-flopped on it pretty hard <laughs> pretty fast and then she left uh, it was an okay episode it wasn't my it wouldn't be one of my favorites of the um won't be one of my favorites of the show the um the fights were good. Everything else was just it was okay. I liked the reveal. I did not expect Bakudo um to be like the hand. <laughs> I didn't expect any of that. So that was a nice surprise. We also got to see a previous Iron Fist actually in the Iron Fist outfit. That was very very cool. Uh, I didn't expect to see the costume in any form on the show. It was cool. It was a good way of uh, incorporating the costume, the original costume into the into the show. So I enjoyed that. Um. I don't have any predictions for this episode. They're probably going to go to Conlon, uh, which I'm excited for. I liked that we got to see this like inner workings, kind of. Uh, it was kind of like seeing the inner workings of the hand uh, last episode, or of a division of the hand or whatever. Uh, I liked that, so I'm looking forward to, if we do go to Conlon, I'm looking forward to seeing Conlon like, properly and seeing like the inner workings and maybe learning more about that side of Danny's life and learning more about his master and how things go there. Um, see, so that would be interesting. That's what I'm hoping for for this episode. Uh, hopefully... I mean, I know it's not going to all focus on there, but hopefully we get some... I want to see some... I want to see what happens with Colleen as well. Um, I don't know how Claire comes into this. She's probably going to be sidelined until Colleen or Danny go back, unless she's going to have some another like side story or something, which I would be fine with. <laughs> More Claire is always a good thing. <laughs> um, and then we have all the, the Meacham stuff as well. The Meacham stuff is starting to ramp up a bit now. I'm, in, I'm, I'm liking where we're going with, with Joy and Harold. I don't think it's going to end well. Um, Harold still is losing it a bit, but they're working as a good team. And I think Joy... I think Joy is more her father than Ward was, uh, which I think is going to be interesting because it'll probably make them clash. And Joy is probably not going to put up with his shit. And it's either going to result in Joy... I don't know how far he could snap like w could he kill joy i don't think so but i don't think joy is going to be like she's obviously not as easy she's not going to be as easy to manipulate uh, and control as ward would as ward was i don't know <laughs> so yeah we're going to jump in check it out see what it's like and discuss it afterwards let's do this i don't know where my remote is Gone forever. <laughs> oh, oh shit! Fuck the remote. Oh shit! Is this when he just got it? Oh, yeah, it is. You're the iron fist. Yeah, you can put your fist down now. <laughs> Damn it! I want, I wanted to see the dragon. <laughs> Damn it! It's not what I thought. I thought they'd give us a little dark sneak peek. 
Oh yeah, he got stabbed by that little little thing. I wonder if it's gonna do on. He can't focus. See, I was thinking maybe the thing that he stabbed him with was what caused that and he was just saying that he can't focus as a way to throw him off and fuck with him even more. And it still could be the case, but it does look like it's, um, it's his emotions just like pouring out. Hmm. I'm gonna quickly get my remote. Ugh. I wasn't chosen. You were. And you took it and run. Is he a bit salty about it? Run. You were gone, Danny. Davos is on board, I think. Team up. I need to get this woman taken care of. I know someone who can help. Someone I trust. Enter. A woman who helped you escape the compound. Clear. Is Bakudo going to be there? Colleen. Yup. Where did you go? He is disappointed. <laughs> when he found out that I was deceiving him? Yes. That I've been keeping the truth from him? What did you think was going to happen? Respect your sensei. I'll take that shit, Colleen. She's seen through the bullshit. He's a friend. Are you the healer? I... What? We need your help. <laughs> uh. Oh my god. Got it? Oh, it broke off. Was I right? Was that what... Is that what was stopping his... Him from iron fisting up? She knows about the iron fist. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody knows about the Iron Fist. <laughs> Not right now. He didn't try. Do this. Ah! Oh, just, just a few more. I'll just do them one at a time, okay? <laughs> oh, it really hurts. Oh, why don't you do something? <laughs> Look at one? Davos. <laughs> to me where the hell you and Colleen went. A completely different mystery man. Davos. You mentioned that. <laughs> it's your bad one. Danny. Danny. Oh Calm shit. The F down. So much for having your emotions in check. I guess that is what's fucking up as G. Too many aggro would be crime fighters keep showing up hurt and cleaning out my supplies. <laughs> She's gonna have a lot more on her plate once the defenders <laughs> assemble. <Here>. It's clean. <laughs> a friend of mine left it here. Oh! Nice. And okay. Probably doing better than you are. <laughs> That's cool. The hand has taken away so many years from us. And we're going to make them pay for it. Pay with everything they have. <laughs> Look at her face. She kind of, she read into that. What passes for food in this world is poison for both the body and soul. <laughs> okay. Tastes good though. <laughs> you guys don't. Dragons aren't real. Why would you think that? It's a fucking alien invasion. <laughs> like a few like years ago. Like a small thing, like a Komodo dragon. <laughs> no. Or like Pete's dragon. A big fuck off dragon. I don't, I don't know who Pete is. <laughs> Pretend your emotions aren't there. A weapon doesn't know feelings. Huh. So they're not controlling their emotions, they're just burying Don't them. Be back by now. Colleen. I know that hair anywhere. <laughs> Already paid for it. Free Pete is a good start. Think about trying a different name for the group? Like the ear or the arm. The foot? Ah. Ooh. Ooh. It's not it's not horrible. <laughs> reaction to Joe's? <laughs> the best slice in New York. He likes it. Look at him. He's going back for seconds. 
but it's, it's chewy. <laughs> like, they're eating pizza? <laughs> then destroying is going to be all that you are good for. Hell yeah. Thank you, Claire. They are Go dropping ahead. the troop bombs. I love Rosario Dawson so much. <laughs> He's from Kamala. Oh, does he have the Iron Fist too? Davos is not going to yeah. be happy. I do not. Because he's telling everybody. But he's as skilled a warrior as I am. Oh! Bakudo? Oh shit. We're gonna get a 4v1? You need to come with us. Makuto wants to talk to you. Was she... Guess we better not keep him waiting. Damn it! I wanted her to kick their asses. <laughs> Even if we have to murder people to do it. Whatever it takes, Joy. Whatever it takes. And his, so, his body was buried, wasn't it? Ready to turn off the hands accounts. <laughs> It's a little bit more complicated. I mean, if we do this, Stanley was just missing. The hand's not going to take it lightly. Seriously. Oh, it's a bit extreme. Where's Bakudo? Oh, she's going to see. Compound. I think this is might attention? this might open her eyes to huh? how <laughs> good the me? hand is. Because I've ordered them not to. Oh, she knows now. Doesn't look so fucking good now, does it? Right now, you look pretty broken to me. Ho oh, oh. <laughs> ho! Nice. Fuck your nose. Oh! Nice! Come on, yes, arm break. <laughs> That snap sounded nasty. Oh! The two bodies, are they really just sitting outside the compound of the car? It's not my car. And besides, I thought the Iron Fist was my birthright. You wanted to be chosen? He is salty. So am I ever wanted. Is he gonna pull him up on telling everyone? Protect her to guard the pass. Donnie, what is keeping you here? Oh shit! Oh! Wait, we have to wait for Bakuta. Ah. Uh. Davos or Bakudo? I think it's Davos. Yeah. You salty bitch. <laughs> okay! <laughs> we got, um. More Davos, which is nice. Um, I don't like where they're going with this. I, 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 I'm enjoying Davos as a character, um, but it's pretty evident now that they're trying to drive a wedge between Danny and him. And it looks to me like they're eventually going to become maybe enemies, especially the last shot. Especially the last shot of Danny and um, Colleen Hogan and him just standing out in the rain. <laughs> it's so bad. It's like, um, like she, she's basically the only reason why he's not, well, she is, she, she can be the only reason that, um, he won't go back to Conlon, you know? Hmm. And all the jealousy stuff. I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty evident that he's salty over not being picked and he resents Danny a bit for it. And especially all the leaving stuff then that just piles up on top of it. Um, and he, he. I thought they were going to make a deal of it, um, but they obviously didn't. It might come back in a future episode, but the fact that Danny's just going around willingly telling everyone that he's the Iron Fist and telling people about Conlon and like how he got the Iron Fist powers and all this, and that was like he seemed to be probing people a little bit. Um, so I don't think he is <laughs> too happy with Danny going around telling everyone stuff as well. So it seems like they're trying to they're trying to slowly separate him. Um, I would like for them to not, I would like for that to not happen. I would like for them to maybe, maybe make it seem that it's going that way. And then they have to join forces and they become friends again. Once Colleen finally leaves the hand 
properly. I mean, she has the knowledge now that they're not who they say they are and that they're actually like bad. Um, so I would like for that to happen. Maybe Colleen gets out and then they all join forces at the end. <clears throat> so a Davos V Danny fight would be good. I want that before <laughs> before whatever happens before if they make up or whatever. I liked Claire's um questioning about the uh about how they deal with their emotions and all that and she was basically like she was like you're not controlling them you're just burying them burying them and that's why um like i mean it makes sense that's why danny is the way he is now they're all just pouring out because he, he's not dealing with the emotions he's not controlling them like he's not he's just burying them down so they're all just piling on and on and now and now he's just exploding with uh with emotion so that i liked i liked that line with claire and i liked that um that little kind of semi-explanation for it. It was, it was good. All the stuff with the hand was good. Um, was good this episode. I wonder if... Probably not. Like, my my thing with Gao was... I was thinking, like, they could sideline Gao and have her pop up in the Defenders because I thought Gao was going to be, like, the main big bad for this season. And they kind of pivoted a bit now. And um, Gao could come back or she could just come back for one episode and then fuck off for the Defenders. Um... But they seem to have pivoted to Bakudo. Now, I got a random thought during the episode. I was thinking, what if they are doing all this as a setup for the defenders? Like, you have Bakudo training an army. He has He's putting these people in higher up positions, like good jobs, higher up jobs. So maybe they need, they're doing that to position people in higher up places for when they need them. Um, and this could all be set up for the defenders. Because... We still have all the Meacham stuff and the fact that Harold, if if it is all true and Harold did have Randall killed, it, they could pivot to the Meachams as well, but I don't know. Like, how formidable would Harold be? He's not going to be that formidable in terms of, like, um, fighting Danny kind of thing. So, I was just, it was just a random thought that maybe all this was set up for the defenders. They're building this army. They have all the ups, But it could just be... They pivoted to Bakudo now and then Gao gets out and she fucks off for the defenders. That's probably what it's going to be. We got the Luke Cage t-shirt. We got the incident mention. Um, I liked all the stuff in the opening and all the like little backstory. I doubt we're actually going to get to see the Undying, the dragon. Um, just because of budget and stuff. <laughs> I doubt they're going to show it. I'd say what we saw now is probably the best we're going to get. But I was fine with it. I liked that they actually acknowledged and basically showed us that that the dragon is real <laughs> you know uh i know they, they, they they've they've referenced it now and then and all that but they have actually properly shown us it here and th that shot of, of danny with like the uh with the, the tattoo just like like what was it like just a stride on him like he's just had to get it on the blood and all that that was that was cool i like that it was a cool shot i just thought it was neat i didn't expect like when, when i was going into this i was like i was thinking like because netflix they do it's it's superhero world and all that, but it's kind of like semi-realistic and it's like ground level, a small kind of uh, small scale superheroes, basically. So I didn't think, I just didn't think they were going to do <laughs> like the proper origin story with him punching an actual dragon kind of thing. Uh, or I just thought they were going to reference it, but actually showing us a little bit of it is, um, is pretty cool. Uh, maybe maybe if they get a, a bump in budget next season, they might show some of it or, or something like that. Maybe they've opened the door for it anyway. I like that Joy is like, she can see that Harold is... Not quite all there. I like that. I wish Danny was a bit more suspicious. Danny just seems to be like all in at the moment. That I could, as I said, it could be the inexperience of social interactions in this real world because he was in Conlon for so long. But he still needs to, he still needs to question it stuff a little bit. I mean, Harold is uh, going off. He's after. He's on the crazy side. Like he's after properly going on to the crazy side. I just like the joy. Um, the joy noticed it. The episode went a lot different than I expected. I thought they were going to go back to Conlon. <laughs> I thought the episode was going to start with them in Conlon, and I mean, I technically did, but I thought they were all going to be there. So I don't, I don't know if he's actually ever going to go back to Conlon now, because if he goes back there and the doorway closes, then he's stuck there. You know, so I don't know if he's actually going to go back there now. I thought they might have gone come back for an episode. He f centers his chi and like has a, like a life lesson and comes back like stronger or whatever. You know, the usual stuff. Um, so I, I like that it didn't go that way. I like that it's it a bit of a difference. I wonder, I wonder how next next episode is going to go because they are. It was only the top of the pen. <laughs> they're in the compound. They, they, they. Davos and Danny were just literally sitting outside the compound in a car. 
there's nobody patrolling that place nobody questioning like why there's just a car sitting outside with two guys in it i mean come on <laughs> i just thought that was funny um and we also had colleen kicking the shit out of t the two people escaping running danny goes into the compound meets up with her and they have this big heartfelt thing and then dan was just standing behind him there's nobody after her after she escaping now she could have knocked him out and all that but like there's nobody there's no cameras there there's nobody spotted her running or i mean could happen next episode it could start with them getting caught or an alarm going off or something so maybe i just thought it was <laughs> i just thought it was funny so um i don't have a whole lot more so i am going to call it at that we only have three episodes left i think it's three episodes left so we're getting to the last few now very exciting so yeah <laughs> thank you very much for watching we will be back next week with some more iron fist reactions and um, we'll also have some other game videos and reactions on the channel during the week as well we have castlevania uh, episode 2 reaction coming out this week with me and gary so you can look forward to that you can like content subscribe if you liked the video if you didn't it is all good we have some social media links and a website address down below in the description if you want to check them out as well and um yeah i think that's it then <laughs> we'll see you next time Later. From different galaxies, there's a force at play that's paved the way for you and I to live mistakes with an eerie thumb, a thumb in palm, a chance to find the